What is up everyone and welcome back to more Demon Slayer! I am excited for this one. So, the Hashira have, well I'm not gonna say it's all of them, but one of them has decided to provoke Nezuko to see if it's possible. I mean, I don't even know if it's to see if it's possible that she would actually try and attack him to prove a point, whatever. I just think he's being a dick, okay? I'm just gonna throw it out there. I think he's just being a bit of a douche lord. So, the last episode ended with Nezuko coming out of the box. She's obviously annoyed because the guy decides to stab her how many times? Okay, we only have four more episodes left of Demon Slayer and then we are done. I don't know how it's gonna end and I just, I hope for the best, but I don't know. I can't even like say predictions or anything like that because this show has been so wild. It's not been anything that I expected, so I have absolutely no idea. Don't forget if you want to watch these before anybody else, you can head on over to the VIP on my website. Also, please feel free to hit me up over on my social media. Pretty soon, I guess I'll be taking some recommendations for another small series, not anything crazy like One Piece or anything like that. But obviously when we finish Demon Slayer, we're gonna have a slot that opens up. So exciting. All right, let's do this. Like Come I am on, ready to lose my patience at this point. Stop it's gonna happen. It's the human blood you love so much! <laughs> Kill! What's she gonna do? Oh my god. What's she gonna do? Oh, she's dribbling! God, and Tanjiro just has to lie there and watch this. Ease up a bit, will you? I'm only doing this because he's trying to escape. I mean, obviously, it's not nice having someone sit on you. My heart goes out to this unfortunate child. Namu Amita Butsu. <laughs> oh my god. Nezuko, just settle, petal. I know what you want to do, but don't do it. <laughs> oh! Oh my god, he's helping! <laughs> Oh my god. She wouldn't. I don't think she's gonna attack. I I don't think so. Oh god, I hate this! Why are you dragging it out like this? It's making me feel like something really bad's gonna happen. I convinced her that all humans are her family. I told her to protect them. Oh my god. But even when they're attacking you though, can you? I will never hurt them. Is this the first time we've heard her speak? Come on, don't do it. Just sit down. Sit down. Yay! Well? Tell me what happened. The demon girl turned her head away in disgust, despite Shinizugawa stabbing her three times. And then flaunting his bloody arm in front of her face, she restrained herself from biting him. Exactly. What do you think you're doing, Tomioka? Tanjiro. I'm sure that even after this, there are some who cannot accept Nezuko. Prove to them that you and Nezuko can be helpful to our cause by fighting as demon slayers. Oh my god, like, we're literally getting a pass from the lead guy! Go out and defeat a 12 Kizuki. Do that and you will be accepted by all. Your words will carry more weight as a result. <laughs> Does this mean that we're almost better than all the people sitting down there behind us? Because we've even fought the main bad guy. Rest assured, we will strike him down and stop this endless cycle of misery! That is a bit ambitious for you two. Let's start by defeating a 12 Kizuki first. <laughs> yes, sir. They have trained themselves to the brink of death and have defeated it, as well as those of the 12 Kizuki. 
Yes, a noble pursuit. That is why the Hashira receive respect and favorable treatment. So it would be best for you to mind your manners when addressing them, Tanjiro. Well, I mean, they were being horrible to us first, not the other way around. <laughs> I That's love Nezuko. We have concluded our business with you, Tanjiro. You may step back. Allow me to take Tanjiro into my abode. <laughs> Pardon me for cutting it right! Why does everything have to be so extra? Please, allow me to headbutt that man covered in scars! I need to do it! <laughs> Please let me headbutt that man! Settle down now! Let go of me! Cut it out! Right, okay. Just leave now. Yes, sir! Oh, come on! He just... He wanted to get his own back on behalf of his sister. That is all. I will never forgive you! Neither will I! Apologize to us! Yeah! Apologize. I am so happy that we are getting the hell out of that place. I mean, that would make me never want to be like a top demon slayer ever. I don't want to be a part of that. Hey, walk on your own two feet. I'm sorry. You know what, though? What happened to Inosuke? Zenitsu, where did they go? Wasn't this place called the Butterfly Mansion? There is someone here. Oh, that, be, uh, that was the uh, one that was chasing oh, us right. before. Ichiguko. Why does she look so it's sad all the time? From final selection. From what I was told, she stumped you real good last night. You don't remember that? Please forgive us, Lady Tsuyuri. We were ordered to come here by Lady Kocho. Permission to enter the mansion, ma'am. Does she speak? <laughs> Does she not you speak? Don't mind, do you? Who are all of you? We're here on behalf of Lady Kocho. That boy is injured, correct? You're the Kakushi. Please come this way. So she doesn't say anything. Okay, she's a mute. She's got a really creepy smile. And I have to keep taking it for three months? It's such a horribly bitter taste still. Would you rather be killed by the spiders, Zenitsu? Still making a fuss, even now. Even just one time, huh? What happened to my legs? Zenitsu! Zenitsu, look behind you! What is actually wrong with him? Zenitsu! <laughs> what happened? Are you all right? So you came up the mountain after all. Ah, it was terrible, Tanjiro. Just awful. I got bit by this icky spider, and it really hurt. Did you get smaller or something? I almost got turned into a spider. So my arms and legs are really short right now. Wait, so what? That's, what happened. that's possible? But Inosuke is right over there. Hi, Inosuke! Oh, you're right! He's been here all this time, and I didn't notice? Oh, that's mean! I was so oh, sure we were gonna lose my poor boy! Sorry. I was just... Oh. I rescue you! Say something! It's okay. Don't worry about it. Help! I heard he mangled his throat or something. Huh? Oh no. I don't know all the details, but I heard he got hit in the neck. And when he yelled at the top of his lungs sometime after, that's what pushed him over the edge. You know, it's kind of funny. <laughs> yeah. You know he's gonna punch you the first chance he gets, right? I'm sorry for being so weak. <sighs> I know! Like head punching you know skate back. Did I take my morning medicine? Did you see me take it? Did anybody I feel like Zenitsu's got the energy for everybody in the room right now. It's so nice though. We're all sleeping in our beds, we're all in the same room, and I Zenitsu. thought we were gonna lose them all, you know. Inosuke. They're just like the three biggest mismatches that you could ever ask for. I just I love them so much. 
It feels like things are like finally starting to pick up. I don't know. I feel really happy with where we're at just now. That whole encounter up on the mountain was really brutal. I gotta be honest. Everything hurts right now. <sighs> Nezuko. What you did, protecting me on the mountain, thank you. I have to become stronger. Take today. If it weren't for the Hashira's master, we may not have been spared. I just can't believe how over the top the Hashira were. Who is he exactly? <laughs> She's exhausted. I have to keep pushing forward. That's because I'll be a grown man one day. And then I'll become old and pass on. If you're still a demon, then you'll be lonely. That would be far too lonely, wouldn't it? So you want her to go back to being regular so you can die together? We must bolster the ranks of the Demon Slayers. What then are your thoughts? The incident on Mount Natagumo says it all. The caliber of Demon Slayers has dropped tremendously. There are those who've joined us after their loved ones were slaughtered. And there are those of noted pedigree who have hunted demons for generations. But for everyone else, it's another matter. Asking laymen for the same or even greater commitment to our cause, I feel, would be much too cruel. The fact that Lower Five Demon made such a drastic move likely means Kibutsuji is far from Mount Naragumo. To be honest, it's quite frustrating. But as long as those demons linger as they do now, freely devouring humans and gaining strength as a result, there is only one thing for us to do, for the sake of those who have died. Keep on fighting! Sanemi Shinazugawa. He reminds me of Kachan from My Hero Academia. Ryu Tomioka. My beloved children, I look forward to seeing your success. I don't know why, I feel like the master is evil. I feel like I get this vibe from a lot of people in anime, but I don't know. Muzan Kibutsuji. I swear that I shall defeat you. Maybe not. We will bring you down without fail. Interesting. Okay, so he literally just proved me wrong in that exact final sentence just then. I am so beyond relieved to see Inosuke, Zenitsu, we're all in the hospital, we're all recovering, and it's funny actually like getting up to this point it kind of feels like we haven't done much on our journey. When you think about the overall bigger picture, like he's gotten a little bit stronger, but strong enough? Like, I don't know. I feel like we only have a couple of episodes left of Demon Slayer, but there's no way that it's suddenly gonna all just come to like a dramatic end by episode 26. I just don't see it. So I can definitely tell that we're probably gonna have either the movie will continue from this story, or season two, but I definitely don't feel like we are anywhere near a resolution of this main story. But I guess I will have to just keep watching to find out. Thank you so much for watching this episode with me, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.